Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's hard to know what time at the end of the day. Uh, people um, get tired. <laughs> okay. Okay, I, I, I do short this time. And, uh, so uh, last time we did uh, blood agar on chapter chapter 42 and uh, 525, and there's Abram's plate. And uh, again, let, let's, let's summarize what I see here. Uh, from Star of the Kirkus Warriors, uh, we see the stabbing, stabbing over here, and streaking over here, stabbing or uh, streaking on both shield. Uh, Hemolysis, we know, uh, with, with, with clear color, which is uh, beta hemolysis, right? And uh, strep leucocorus, uh, pyogenes show green color hemolysis uh, in both streaking and also stepping. Uh, and strep leucocorus epidemides did, didn't show any, any hemolysis of the gamma. And from a mouse, uh, mostly show uh, from mouse of uh, of the abrams microbiota is mostly show green color hemolysis, including streaks, uh, 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 around the streaking and stabbing. And here is a full plate showing the oral, uh, oral microbiota and also the green color hemolysis surround the stabbing and also on the surface. So um, yeah. I'm going to ask question here. Uh, on the surface and uh, in the stab, in the, around stabbing, uh, there are two types of chemolysis. I don't remember which type. Which type of uh, chemolysis produced around uh, from stabbing inside the agar? Go to look at the book. The two types. The trap. Streptolysin S and O. Which one is it? S and O? From stepping. Oh. So it must be O. Ah. And O is an Austin label, right? Unstable. So that means that they are produced under anaerobic condition. So on the surface, as stable, so that they are produced from uh, bacteria, bacteria under the Aerobic growth, right? Make sense? So I'm going to ask uh, Abby another question. Um, why there is a, there are red blood cells in, in this plate? Abby? I'm not sure. We'll ask your friends. Is there any special purpose by adding? fresh red blood cells into the agar. Anyone? What did you see? What did you see of the surrounding of the area surrounding the colonies? Yes is to indicate hemolysis. Lysis is the right by cell. This is like, like, like the indicator, right? Like, okay, uh, Abel, what's your uh, McConkey? Uh, was it here? Okay. So the Abel's McConkey agar. Uh, what color of E. coli on the McConkey agar? Everybody? Uh, like pink? Yes, yeah, it's a pink color, right? Uh, okay, uh, Abel. When you see the pink color, what can you make of the color about E. coli or in the media? Can you think? Uh, look, look at the look at the McConkey agar, which is the four or five chapter four or five. Pay attention to the median recipe. First of all, the color. Color is indication of what? The fermentation of lactose? Uh, yes, it's close. 
First of all, let's see the color. And the color can be, can be white or can be pink. The color is indication of... PH. Yeah, it's a pH indicator. And when, uh, actually the color, the color comes from neutral red. And when pH uh, go lower than seven, the neutral, then the, the color will turn pink. When you go uh, stay in neutral or above, uh, the color will stay white. Okay, uh, the second, what make the pH lower? Yeah, I agree, it was the answer. Fermentation. Yeah, fermentation of lactose. Uh, the, the, the waste products or the waste uh, form of fermentation is acidic products. Okay, uh, then if you look at the uh, star blue crackers, star blue crackers activities, it's no growth, right? If you see growth, most likely from uh, con coarse contamination. You bring the E. coli on your side, it happened several times. Uh, then, Abram, why star blue crackers? I have trouble to grow on my conkey. Gram positive? It's gram positive. So what is the um, chemicals in the media, in the media or medium that suppress or suppresses E. coli from, oh, not E. coli, suppresses from um, staphylococcus from growing? The biosalts and chrysovirus? Yeah, good job. The biosalts and the uh, chrysovirus. Chrysovirus go against the, the gram part of the cell to make the effective cell wall. Okay, how about your skin? Uh, I bring your skin and your mouth, a microbiota, uh, all type of trouble to grow. Uh, maybe it's, you can barely see, but a very, 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 very poor growth. Can you make of that your skin and your mouth? The, the, I mean the microbes from, from your mouth, from your skin, from your fingers, and from your mouth. Why do you have trouble to grow up? Yeah, because, yeah, on the skin, mostly, uh, and also in the oral cavity, gram-positive bacteria, more abundant. Right? Okay, very good, good job. I'll give a hand. Bye-bye. Okay, I